Check, check. All right, now we should be working. All right, now are we working? It sounds like it. All right, so welcome guys to episode two of Cooking with Flying. Problems, as always, I'm starting to dislike this camera as whenever I go on the stream and I start my uh, five minutes prior to the stream, it shuts down and then I have to shut down everything, turn off my computer, restart my computer to be able to get this going and then now my mic don't work. And so, problems, but that's what happens when, you know, you stream live and you get all the, this stuff and you don't just press the live button and, you know, <laughs> if I'm gonna eat your food, yeah, right, you have to come over and get it. All right, so today we are going to be cooking some chicken katsu. Let me find the chicken katsu screen. There we go. We got our chicken. And I did marinate the chicken. Normally you don't have to marinate the chicken. You just want to get boneless chicken thighs. But I kind of wanted to try it out to see if it's a little bit more tastier. And I think it's going to be a lot more tastier. I mean, it's still really, really good. But I think it's going to be even better. So I did make a pre-episode of a pre-video of me marinating. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys that right now. Um, what's the first thing we do, Connor? I'm already... There, I'm just sitting outside. So what's the first thing we do? I'm gonna test you this every single time. There we go. So first I'm gonna wash my hands before anything. And then actually before we get to making anything while my video is up since you guys already seen how I make my steamed rice I'm gonna make the steamed rice while you guys watch the how I make the marinade video okay I'm gonna show you how I'm marinating the chicken katsu you really don't need to marinate it but I just want to try it out and see how it tastes it should be super duper tasty this is the same for my teriyaki chicken except for I use teriyaki chicken uh, marinade. I got pi Paradise Pineapple Teriyaki. So pretty much what we got to do is we have to have chicken thighs, boneless. We got our plastic bag. Dump all the chicken inside. Open up the bottle. And so normally I like to have a two day marinade, but I didn't marinate it last night because I wanted to make this video and I was kind of putting it off. So tomorrow is our episode. So it's gonna be marinated in a good 24 hours. 28 hours because it's 130 right now.
added a tiny bit of water in there so we can get all the juices inside. Zip lock it up. So now we just want to get that marinade all over. And then I do mix it up a couple times throughout the day. So I'll take it out in another few hours. As you can see, there's no like marinade here as we're opening it up. So you really want to have the marinade all over. Let all the air out. There you go. This goes into the fridge for the next day. I'll, like I said, I'll massage it out, get the marinade everywhere and then we'll open it up tomorrow for some chicken katsu. All right, so that's the, how I marinade the chicken. And yeah, no marinade with Red Bull. So we have the rice already here. Let's plug it in. Plug it in, plug it in. And so rice is pretty much the first thing that you wanna make because it's going to take the longest. I do have... I do have the oil cooking up over here. Um, so that's still getting ready. White rice is cooking. Next thing we are gonna set up. There we go. Now we're gonna set everything up for our chicken production. What we're gonna need is flour in a bowl. over a little bit so we have a little bit more room can't see the whiteness but flour eggs in the bowl mixed up I do have quite a bit of chicken in there I think there's at least 12 pieces maybe a little bit more So if Joe want to come over, because I know we ain't going to eat it all. Sorry, Connor. Only if you're a little bit closer. Here we go. We got the eggs. Let's go ahead. Mixy, mixy. I don't know if we can see anything. And right now I'm only guessing on how many eggs, how much flour we need. If I need more, then I'm gonna add more. Eggs are now ready. And then, panko breading. 
I do have another box of this because I really wasn't sure of how much stuff I actually needed. Open up the bag, dump it in. like it is ready so let's go ahead and open up our chicken Here we go first chicken what you want to do with the chicken pound the chicken out so you can flatten it up but since I already marinated, I don't want to pound too hard because it's going to squirt all over me. Flip it over. Chicken's falling over. Okay, so here we go. Put it in the eggs. I probably need more egg. Go to the eggs, to the flour, coat it in the flour. All right. Now we throw it in the panko breading. I'm actually going to move this camera. And I don't think you can go down. But from the panko, then we go ahead and throw it into the fryer. I'm gonna try to adjust this so we can get a view. I need a cameraman. Right now, clip bars my cameraman. Okay, looks good. First one's up. There we go, so you guys can see it over there, see what my next one's gonna do. Same process. Found out the chicken, even though you guys can barely see the chicken. Throw it in the eggs. Flour. I see Julie's here. She wants to learn how to make some chicken katsu. don't have a timer on this it's about three minutes per side the rice is really going to be lagging behind So 
So, while we're cooking, I'll catch up with the chat. How's it going, guys? What's up, little caveman? Fine said I ain't eating mine. Yeah, you have to come over here first. Joe's gonna come over and eat it all. Julie was napping last week. No, you missed out. Locomoco, what's up, Zen? Ben got some kimchi for us. Okay, so after I start cooking a few more, I'm gonna show you guys how to make the katsu sauce. And I really need to get a timer. Because I just like not having a timer and just swinging it. Hopefully you don't get no splatters. Not a good spot. I was gonna try to show you guys the time. Is uh, ready. And so the temperature on that's about a 350. Go ahead, change this, turn this over. Katsu sauce is super simple to make. The ingredients are ketchup, all right, got the ketchup, Worcestershire, you a little bit. Mixy mixy. And I've got to turn on my timer. So we got the blue bowl. For the non-hot sauce people. The other bowl is gonna be for the hot sauce liking people, which is myself. Or sire, so you, and then the sriracha, my favorite. This one's going to be a little bit more spicier. Let's go ahead and flip our chicken.
That one's way better. <laughs> but I like sriracha. Sriracha, sriracha! All right, on with our next chicken. Egg. And I know I'm in your guys' way. More flour. Pinko. And then this one, it will be ready for when that one's ready. About another minute. Yep, doing good. I can't wait to get a tasty bite of mm, tasty goodness. Connor's playing some American Truck Simulator. When are you going to get... What's the game that we're playing? Ball Guys. American Truck Simulator. Don't know. Save a mom, please. Next one is oh so ready. So that was about five minutes. Five minutes. I'm gonna move this out of the way. Hey session. Andrew gets a lot. So these are the kids' plates once when the rice is ready. Rice is gonna be just a moment.
quite a few moments. So I do think like next episode, So yeah, I do think like next episode I will be probably pre-making rice just because the rice always takes a lot longer to make and you really have to time it out so like we always make the rice before, go chill for a little bit, come back and then start making the food because it's probably about half an hour just for the rice to cook out and be ready. So all the chicken's going to be ready, hopefully by the time. It goes beep, 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 beep. Egg, flour. Get some panko. I think the panko is going to be way more than enough. get dirty panko hands like that. Next chicken. Red day. So many views. I added a bunch of views to the scenes and everything. All right, next up on the list, let's go ahead and read you what chicken katsu is. Chicken katsu, also known as panko chicken or tori katsu, is a Japanese dish of fried chicken made with panko breadcrumbs, which is popular in Australia. Hawaii, London, California. Chicken katsu is generally served with tonkatsu sauce, a thick Japanese vegetarian puree, fruit-based brown sauce, or well-seasoned ketchup. So that's basically how we made the katsu sauce there. As a Hawaiian mixed plate lunch meal, it generally served with shredded cabbage, not having that, rice or miso soup, as part of a two or three item combo or as a dinner with rice and vegetables. In Hawaii, chicken katsu is also common as tokatsu, pork cutlets. It's also served in place of tokatsu and katsu curry. I really like chicken katsu curry, that's super bomb. And katsu don in local plate lunch restaurants and in fine dining Japanese establishes establishments alike. So that's on the Wikipedia. teach you guys a little bit and hi Amanda how you doing and so I mean the reason why I have these episodes is because you never know this might be something that you like to cook and I'm not as you can tell I'm not really good at making regular videos I mean I, I do like making regular videos but it just takes so long to edit and then by the time I get to the editing it's like I'm done with this because I have like so many videos just from Hawaii that I can make uh, that I took footage of. Julie knows all the footage that we took in Hawaii. And I only got to like two or three episodes of the Hawaii vlogs. And so I need an editor and all that stuff. And <laughs> so one of these days, one of these days. What's up, Animal Show? 
Thanks guys for coming on. And so, like my daughter, she really likes uh, like the teriyaki chicken. Like how do I, she always asks me, how do I make the teriyaki chicken? So at least you can go to the beginning of this episode and then see the marinade, because that's the most important part. She's got to marinate the chicken for at least a day, two days is preferable, because then the juices really soak up in the chicken. And that's pretty much the hardest part in it. But then I also want to, because I mean, I do have some of you guys that are always on here and maybe, hey, one of these days you can make your family something like a chicken katsu. You see how quick this chicken katsu is being made. And it's really, I spent like $12 on the chicken for like 12 to 15 pieces. Um, you don't need the marinade. Marinade's $5. Panko crumbs, probably $1.50. Flour, hopefully your parents have flowers. If you don't have flour, then a dollar, I don't know how much flour it is. Uh, eggs, probably two fifty dollars for a dozen eggs. 10 minutes till the rice is done. Uh, I think I've just named it all off. I mean, you should have ketchup. Board size sauce is probably pretty expensive. I think it's like five or $7 for a bottle. Sriracha, if you like sriracha, but yeah, it's just, these are like really simple recipes that you guys can try out at home. And it's like one of my, like all my favorite stuff is what I'm pretty much making you. Like next week I plan on tr trying to make some hamburger curry. And that's like super duper bomb. That's like one of my favorite things. I've always tell you guys these are my favorites, but that's like my favorite home dish food to eat. Next chicken coming out. So this is taking about five minutes, two two thirty per side. And I don't have another one ready. Need my split screen. So again, we have about 10 minutes till the rice is ready. Then I can go feed off the kids and then I'll cut one final one up. Show you guys the finishing plate. Chili's asking what's next week on the menu. Hamburger curry. Whenever Julie would come and visit, she would always ask for hamburger curry. But now she wants... Man, I don't know why I don't remember that place. Welcome to China Panda. Not China Panda. It's not China Panda. No, it's not China Star. What is it, Julie? But she wants the orange chicken from that Chinese place. Oh, Great China. Great China, how may I help you? Super duper bomb. Since nothing's going on over there, well, I guess you guys can watch the rice for me. Connor, make sure the rice don't burn. I still got like... This is like going to be more than enough for us. Told you, don't burn it, man. You 
watching it good. Wish you guys could be here for some tastiness. Uh, five. So you guys can still watch the fry. So yeah, last week with the loco moco, too much salt in it. So don't put as much salt. It was super tasty at first because it's very tasty right at the beginning, but then when it sits, then all the juices get sucked into the hamburger in. Uh, I used the, the breading, the mix, the onion soup mix, and so that already had salt in it, and then I already over-salted it, so it was super salty by the end of the night, but it was still good. It was still bomb, bomb diggity. I still enjoyed it. So, no salt added to any of this. And it's like, really, like I said, all you really need to do is just get some chicken thighs, boneless, smash it up. Dipping in the egg. Egg, flour, panko. Then we're ready. Cook it on your fryer, or if you just have a pan, put some oil in it, about 350. 30 on each side so this one's about ready our next deliciousness Ooh, that one looks very good very very good my friends my friends so julie you think you're gonna make some of this one of these days connor i said watch the rice <laughs> Don't be looking at me. <laughs> you are going to burn it if you don't watch it. Three minutes. But yeah, so again, once when the rice is ready, turn me a little bit. Once when the rice is ready, then I'll make the kids plate, go give it to the kids in the back. Which one was the hot one? In the blue? <laughs> no, the blue, the, this one was the, the lesser made one. The blue is the cold. So I'm gonna go give the kids the food and then I'm gonna make one final plate to show you how it's served. The only thing is that no macaroni salad today. Not that I don't like macaroni salad. I'm just not like a mayonnaise guy. I do like macaroni salad. But yeah, so it's just gonna be pretty plain. Rice, chicken katsu, sucks. Mwah. Tasty. You can't watch and drive. No texting and driving, no watching YouTube videos while you're driving your big truck. 
you know what's gonna happen. Then you lose your payload. All right, gotta make another chicken. Get prepared. One minute for the rice. I know, but he does that on purpose. I don't know what you, what's up with you guys and wanting to run me over. You and Tan, I'm gonna play a friendly game and then here it goes. Instant death. You were killed by Connor and Tan because they want to run you over with the tractor and the truck. Awesome game, awesome game. I got the detectives all over you, man. I have it on video evidence. Video evidence, three hours. Watch the video, 12 hour subscriber special. splattered that's what happened all right it's time to set up some kids plates again steamed rice is like my absolute favorite side I can have steamed rice every single day every single meal This is Mr. Andrew's plates, Mr. Spider-Man. Mercedes, Little Moana. Get him some forks. And then guys, wait, one sec. Okay, watch the chicken for me. Make sure it don't burn. Connor, stop your driving. And I'll be back in one minute. Squeeze, squeeze. How's it turning out? How's it turning out?
All right, guys. Wrong picture. We got our Steve Rice. Throw the sauce on top or on the side. I was going to put it on the side, but then it looks better on the top. Okay, there we go. Chicken katsu. I know you guys want to see me eat this deliciousness. Super good. As always, and so that is the chicken katsu plate. Chicken thighs with panko breading, katsu sauce on top of rice, no veggies, sorry. Um, the only veggies I really like is broccoli and it kind of doesn't go with this. So, no veggies with that, but this is one of those easy type of meals. I mean, you saw how quick I made everything. I was really just waiting on the rice and this episode ended up being like 50 minutes. So yeah, with that, this will complete our episode for today. I will be jumping back on with Kingdom Hearts 2 tonight, 9 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. We are going to go back into Olympus and then do another world, probably Little Mermaid or Pirates of the Caribbean. Is it Caribbean or Caribbean, Julie? <laughs> but yeah, thanks again, guys, for joining me. I hope you guys enjoyed this, and we will see you on the next video. Bye, guys.